Are you Dragorax is back and welcome to another new world video here on my channel guys and today I want to show you two rapiers that are in my opinion best in slot for the next patch and for the upcoming nerf of the rapier with the longer cooldowns. Today I want to show you two rapiers especially one rapier that I have here now that is very useful in the next patch and you should definitely go for it when you want a good defense rapier. Let's start with the rapier that I have in my inventory now and this rapier is out of the garden dungeon it's the sacred wood saber. For me, after the patch, this is one of the best or the best rapiers in the game when you want the defense rapier. We have 30 decks here, we have refreshing move, we have the omnidirectional evade here. Yeah, like you guys know from my last build video, normally I'm using this one here. Yeah, This is also with omnidirectional evade. I have all the other skill perks on my armor, so it's perfect when you want all the six skill perks yeah then omnidirectional evade is definitely a good thing here and we have refreshing yeah we have refreshing move and refreshing for example in the next patch we have 18 seconds cooldown on our repost in the moment before the nerf it was 12 seconds so refreshing overall is getting stronger in the next patch for our build yeah we have here refreshing refreshing move is also getting stronger and also refreshing evasion is more interesting than yeah you guys know after three dodges you have the same amount like with the normal refreshing and when you do more than three dodges, refreshing evasion is better than normal refreshing. In 18 seconds, we can definitely do three dodges or more than three dodges with the evade. Yeah, we get some stamina back. So it's also a very strong perk on the armor that you can go. And yeah, guys, we have refreshing here on our weapon. So next patch, we have 18 seconds cooldown. And one refreshing more is already 0 0.52 seconds cooldown reduction on our repost. This is a lot. In a moment, one refreshing is... I think around 0 0.35 seconds and next patch we have 0 0.52 seconds cooldown reduction. So that means refreshing is now more important in our build. Before it wasn't so interesting, it was nice to have because we have low cooldowns on the spear, we had low cooldowns on the rapier, it wasn't so important. In the next patch it's more important like for example on a mage or on a bow build they play with a lot of pieces with refreshing because they have long cooldowns and it's a must have in their build. Now we have also longer cooldowns on the rapier and when you still want to play defensive rise we should definitely go with some refreshing pieces. And here I want to show you something that is also very strong and definitely check that you have skilled this passive here. When you hit the crit you get also 5% cooldown reduction. In the current patch before the nerf yeah, we have 17 seconds on the flash. Yeah? So it's basically it's a bit less than the repost in the next patch. But I want to show you something. When we do only crit hits in the back of enemy for example. Look how fast we get the cooldown ready again. Yeah? Because we have refreshing move we get extra 5% cooldown reduction with the crits. Now I want to show you the rape here that is also very strong. And it's basically the same like the sacred wood saber. The rapier I'm talking about is the Shallow Grave and this rapier should drop in the mines in the elite area. You can farm it there from the small bosses. Um, it should be tradable. I checked it on the Nuvo database, it says it's tradable and when you check um, the merchant there you can search it as well. So it should be tradable. On my server there wasn't one. We have 10 strength here, we have 20 decks, we have refreshing evasion instead of the normal refreshing. Then we have also refreshing move. And we don't have the omnidirectional evade, but this is no big deal because evade gets nerfed anyway. We can't play the rapier so offensive anymore. So omnidirectional evade isn't so important anymore. So we have keen there. And like I showed you guys, when we crit, we get also 5% cooldown reduction. So this rapier is also very strong. So at the end, both of the rapiers are basically on the same level and you can choose whatever you like more. For me, the Sacred Wood Saber is the better option here. I like the refreshing and the normal refreshing a bit more because when you swap, for example, the weapon, you don't have the refreshing evasion anymore. And yeah, so I say refreshing, the normal refreshing is better. We have 30 decks here. This also fits better into my build. Yeah, I have already a lot of strength with the jewelry and with the head that I'm using. But when you can use the other rapier, it's definitely also a strong weapon. Yeah, with Keen, we have also a bit more damage for sure. Yeah, we crit more. Yeah, and we have also extra cooldown reduction on the Shallow Grave because the crits. Okay, these are the difference between these two rapiers. And if you guys have still questions, yeah, to these things here, then ask me in the comments below. Feel free to ask me there. And guys, I would say don't forget to like and subscribe. I have to pay my taxes here. <laughs> and we see us in the next video. And bye bye.